Hello. Today I would like to talk to you about the, what could be called the digital response to disasters, by which I mean making use of the web to respond to catastrophic circumstances, and especially leveraging the power of those who are living in areas that are not directly affected in order to have an impact on the ground. Humanity has a long history of helping each other in the cases of catastrophes, disasters and other unpleasant events. This help can take many forms. It can mean providing food, providing shelter, assisting in the search and the rescue and the cleanup and rebuilding. It can mean providing medical aid, financial aid or finding any of those things. The web can basically come in in two main ways. One, it can help enhance and scale up those existing means of helping. That means that you can use the web to help in providing food, shelter, medical aid, and money, and so on. And the second uh, way in which the web can come in is by leveraging the global network of people, communities, and infrastructure um, to produce or do something that is really hard to do on the ground, especially in areas directly affected by a catastrophe. And in this way, uh, the web has actually been used a number of times in the past to respond to catastrophes like earthquakes or disease outbreaks, and I would like to outline some of those examples in my contribution. I hope that this will be of interest to some in the audience, and I'm looking forward to having a discussion afterwards.